Hello everybody, my name is Nia Whiteley and I'm the programme organiser for zoology. And because you can't come and visit us here in Bangor, I thought the best thing to do was just give you a, a few minutes worth of a description of our degree, a little bit about the opportunities that we offer here and also some of our facilities. So zoology is all about the study of animals. And here in Bangor, we put an emphasis on certain subject areas. So things like form and function, how animals interact with their environment, how they interact with each other, how they live in their environments, and why it's so important to preserve their habitats, and also to look at their evolutionary relationships. Now, zoology is a very practical subject, and throughout the three years of our zoology degree, we have a lot of practical classes that will talk about or take you through all sorts of techniques and concepts, or some, some behavioral studies, or some taxonomic studies, or looking at cellular molecular changes and, and the ways in which they are, are regulated. We have newly refurbished laboratories for you to be able to do these practicals. And we also offer a wide range of field courses because we're so lucky here in being sandwiched between the mountains and the sea and we have a natural laboratory on our doorstep. So we're able to offer a whole range of different field courses making use of our, our local environment. And that's either in the second year as part of a local field course trip or it's also part of um, our modules, so let's say life in the wetlands in the third year will take you out into the field and make the most of the um, wetlands that we have on our doorstep. In addition to all of that, of course, we, we're very lucky and very fortunate and we have a whole range of staff that will also take you out into the field overseas. So we have a wide range of overseas field trips that are available to students. So we take students, for example, to Florida or Uganda or India. And we also have field trips in Spain as well, which is a little bit closer. And all of these are available to students in the second year, although, of course, you'd have to choose one of these and not do all of them. In addition to that, there are lots of opportunities in Bangor. So we offer students an opportunity to do international experience so they can go abroad for a fourth year. And you can do that after your second year or even after your third year and get extra experience, let's say, in other universities. Then we have um, what's known as um, exchange opportunities as well, where you could go um, abroad and for about two months or something as, as part of, um, let's say, a conservation or biodiversity project. And, and then use the data that you get in lots of exotic areas of the world to actually um, mark towards your dissertations. So dissertations are third year projects and you can do these on topics that are related to subjects of your own choosing, as long as you can be supervised by one of our members of staff. And there, for zoology, there's a whole range of different projects that you could possibly do, from looking at behavioral responses in primates, for example, to looking at, at um, um, all the sort of processes that might control um, hormones in, in fish or crustaceans, or having a look at how animals um, survive in quite extreme and challenging environments. And in addition to all that, we do a whole range of different subjects in the third year, modules that are quite specialised. They deal with contemporary issues such as climate change, behaviour, animal welfare, and also topics that are related to different taxa, such as primates and birds, for example, which you'll be subjected to or can have an opportunity to do in the second year. In addition to all of this and sort of to try and, and promote and help you in your studies, then we have a whole range of different facilities. So in the Bramble building, which unfortunately you're not able to see today, then we have a wonderful natural history museum. And this museum is quite unusual and it has a, a very extensive range of vertebrate and also invertebrate material that, that's available to, to help you in your studies and is used for a second year module, which is known as vertebrate biology.
In addition to that, we have um, a freshwater and a marine aquarium in the basement of the Bramble Building. And again, this is used to support our research, but also our teaching. And it is possible for you to do a dissertation project, for example, in the aquarium, either using um, marine animals such as fish and, and locally caught crustaceans, or you could use um, or study cichlid fish in, in our um, extensive freshwater aquarium. In addition to that, students run societies and the zoology society is extremely strong, it's very active and it's um, organised by students, for students, and they run a whole different series of activities and also talks, which is in addition to, to what we as academics would offer you here at Bangor. So overall, there's a wide range of opportunities for you here. There's opportunities to go out in the field. There's opportunities to study a whole range of different animals and different habitats and, and different systems. And we really do hope that you will consider doing zoology at Bangor and hopefully maybe see you in the not too distant future. Thank you for listening. <laughs>